Yellow Productions presents the JW Marriott in Beijing, China. The JW Marriott Beijing is located in a newer part of Beijing, right next to the Ritz-Carlton Hotel, about five metro stops from the Forbidden City on Line 1. It is also adjacent to two shopping malls, the China Central Mall and Shin Kong Place. There are also a number of high-rise office buildings in the area, a couple of which shown here have a pretty awesome light show at night. The JW Marriott is truly an impressive five-star hotel. From the entrance lobby to every part of the hotel, it is truly amazing. The hotel has five different restaurants, a steakhouse, the long bar, a tea shop in the lobby, a coffee shop, and my favorite, the buffet restaurant, which had an awesome breakfast buffet, free to Platinum members. The fitness center, spa, and swimming pool are shared between the JW Marriott and the Ritz-Carlton, so sure to be pleasing. The concierge lounge here is definitely one of the better lounges I've been into. It's open from 6 in the morning until midnight, 7 days a week. Domestic Marriott's eat your heart out. It has a great breakfast, but if you're platinum, definitely have that in the restaurant downstairs. They put out a pretty impressive spread for dinner, uh, which I never had, but you could definitely have a full dinner while you're here. I did enjoy the desserts every night, which while small, were quite tasty. Now that we've seen the exterior of the hotel, why don't you come inside my room and check out the amenities. This is room 2012 on the 20th floor, the executive floor. It is a two double bedroom. There is one bed here and the second bed right here. The beds are very nice with the traditional JW Marriott bedding. There is a sitting area for two in the room. The seating area has these very comfortable leather chairs and there were two complimentary apples, or at least I hope they were complimentary. There's a nice view outside of the window with automated curtains. Push a button and they open. At night there was a cool neon building outside and in the daytime you can see the high rises of Beijing. A pretty clear day here. I especially enjoy the tanks of something painted to look like the sky on the right. Modern technology, quite amazing. There's a desk over here. On the desk is a very nice reading lamp, a uh, leather pad on it. Also a very nice little green leafy plant here on the side. This plant is actually real. Next to the desk is a very impressive collection of power outlets that will fit a plug from just about any country. No need to bring your adapter here. Over here is a very large television, 40 inches by the looks of it. Uh, down below the television there is a uh, tea set. And then also to the left of the tea set is a mini bar and small refrigerator. There are also three drawers in this cabinet. Inside the first drawer is a collection of fine liqueurs and Snickers. And in the second drawer is where the glasses in the room are. And the final drawer, well, there's nothing in that one. I'm sorry. Something I really like about the room is that ice is complimentary. And there was a small a uh, thing of ice when we checked in. Very nice. As a Platinum member, uh, I was given the option of welcome gift. I picked the welcome gift of sweets and truffles. Very petite sweets and truffles. And the final part of the room is through this other window here at the back of the room into the bathroom. I always find rooms that have a window into the bathroom to be kind of strange, but I guess some people must like it. These blinds are automated much like the other ones. They don't open and close, but they do rotate. Come on in, check out the rest of the bathroom. Inside the bathroom, there is a separate bathtub and shower, and also a television above the bathtub, a very nice sink, again, big shower, toilet, and opposite the bathroom is a large closet behind a mirror that contains a, a very nice shoe shine kit and shoehorn. This room is closets galore. Opposite the main closet is actually a second closet that lights up and has a safe built into it. 
the do not disturb in the room is set by this little switch right here and same with make up the room overall this was one very nice room in a very nice hotel so if your travels take you to beijing check out the jw marriott for a very comfortable stay